Underground sound off. Sound off. Don't kill shot out of wood. to promo god underground sound off the kill shot hour in syndication on six radio stations in ohio detroit new jersey philly miami and chicago for all independent underground artists worldwide all genres of music click clack bang bang it's a kill shot day promo underground sound off sound off Attention businesses, filmmakers, and artists around the world. Do you need to expand your promotional endeavors? Well, here at Blast Global Media, we can help. Promotion packages starting at $50 per month with a direct link sales to a worldwide market in television and radio. For more information, please contact King Darius at blastglobalmedia at gmail.com. All right, y'all. Happy Team Wee Wednesday. We have a very special show today. The entire show is comprised of three songs and one interview. So that is all Team Wee. This show is dedicated to Toledo, Ohio. So we're going to start it off with D-Boy. He is the co-founder of Team Wee. This is the official Team Weed theme song, but we're waiting on the new Team Weed theme song. And yes, I'm going to get it in there in some kind of way. We need that song, (laughs) D-Boy. We have an interview with Nation of Elevation today, and we have songs out of Toledo, Ohio. And that's all that the show is going to be today. Congratulations, Toledo. You are on the map. 419 Glass City, stand up. Shout out to Real G's in the building, Damiana Leverage. Shout out to Bad Boy Billy Sly, Davy Bone, which is Davy No Fucks, the Nation of Elevation. That's the interview we're doing today. Think you were winning, you winning, I elevate. Ain't no ceiling, we in the gym cause we built it, they wasn't with us. Shout out to Miss Harmony Detroit, Team Wee, that's right, baby. Lisa Johnson, Crazy L Productions in the building. Shout out to Chester, PA. We see you, sweetheart. And again, thank you so much for putting Boss Dog um, on the March 26th show. Salute to you as well, that's right, let's go. My theme music. Every good hero. This next song coming on is I'm by so Stax Lawrence. He is an artist in Toledo, Ohio. And this song is called So Toledo. As soon as this song is over, we're going right into the interview. I'm out the mud. I'm out the mud. I'm out the mud. I'm out the mud. Waving across 
the nip and it's hot and you ain't gotta even be on the corner to set them stop, let's get it started, pop a pill and they aim you straight at the top, execution, men and they a tray about every lock, and they keep calling my phone and saying stacks, you know we need to move, heard he got caught in a lie, it made him plead the truth, first he was drinking rose, then he switched to the ten and juice, then king, he had the hands of the steering wheel, that's ten and two, always thinking feelings, why you think these bitches after me, know that everything that I touch, I make a masterpiece, they know who I am, so they know they just woke up a piece, you know I'm from Toledo, so I'ma go in they city. When I first got established, I started wrecking. Thirteen is when I got a little calmer with the blessing. Fourteen is when I got a little older and learned a lesson. But you can still get your house burnt down like I'm majestic. The flow was in the pudding, even Bill can't touch it. Even if the town was next to the white, they wouldn't brush it. The stairs, cause you in your own lane, then look at the Lisa said flames, hey! Bring it back, cause it ain't nothing for me to bring it back. Animals, but they can never walk right in my habitat. Boot back, when he gave him two shots, give him two more, split it down the middle. Many only get half the fact. Niggas try to act like they're hard, they're being oppressed. You can never try to call me fake, I'm a diamond tester. Don't ever try to merge in my lane, it's just a jester. A ball head and give him a ball head like Uncle Fester. My niggas, I heard from respect and we gon' get it. You know we gotta focus on numbers, that was the ditch. Just thought he had me, but he had no evidence, so guess what? You know he had to quit it. Ah. All right, y'all. We are on location. We are about to do a special pop-up interview. This interview was supposed to have been done last August 2020, and it's 2021 now, fucking February. So we're going to start it off with you are listening to Promo God Underground Sound Off, the Kill Shot Hour. We are on location in Toledo, Ohio with Nation of Elevation and Team We, Team We, baby. So we are about to do this interview, and this interview is going to run on three different radio stations. So let's start off by, who are you, young sir? I'm Davey No Fucks. Hey, hey, and who are you? What do you do? I am the CEO of the Nation of Elevation. I interview local <laughs> talent um, and just bring local talent to the light. Okay, just for Toledo, Ohio, or for any place? Areas like okay. I have an interview that I haven't scheduled yet. That's you know for a guy from Detroit. Okay. So I mean, I'm not opposed to doing different you know areas, but I really highlight the city because Toledo really has nothing. Well, Toledo has a lot of awesome yeah. artists, so right. we appreciate right. the time that you take <laughs> to get to know the artists and to well, you know yeah. let them be aware that there are other people out here that want to hear their music too so thank you very much for doing that so let's introduce everybody first and then we'll get into the big interview <laughs> here so who are you young sir my name is russ i'm part of the nation of relation uh, i'm pretty much the, the ones who protects whoever he's interviewing if they need assistance as a bodyguard okay i'm, I'm there to protect he is security, security. don't fuck with russ <laughs> Russ has been my friend for about oh, at least at least at least ten, twelve, fifteen years. Wow, long time. That's a bond right there. <clears throat> okay. So we got security, we got the owner of Nation Elevation, and look who we got over here, y'all. Mm -hmm. This is the co-founder of Team We. This is D-Boy, Toledo, Ohio. D-Boy and myself are the founders of Team We. So yeah. I am very honored to have met this man in my life because he is pretty fucking important. I'm just saying. <laughs> so Team We Winners Elevating, they already know who you are, but go ahead and tell them who you are again. You know what I'm saying? CEO and you know what I'm saying? Owner in the gym entertainment, you know what I'm saying? Uh... I mean, I'm the boy, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I, 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 I mean, I don't know what else to tell you. I mean, keep listening, keep watching. I mean, they're fine. If they don't know me, they will know me. That's right. Well, they know who you are every Wednesday. Every Wednesday. It's a weekday, not a weekday. That's right, because Team We, we celebrate Team We every Wednesday, but... We, we are win. winners elevating every single day because we believe in ourselves. And that's what we try to emphasize in people, to believe in the power of you. Believe in yourself enough to help another to believe in themselves. Because a lot of us don't tend to believe in ourselves like we should. So. Yeah, that man plays an important part of my life also. If it weren't for him, I, I'd have probably gave up on the nation. Well, we're glad that you didn't. Keep pushing those artists. My so... 
What we're going to do is we're going to, we can go free for all or whatever. I'm just going to throw a question out there, but mostly um, Davy no fucks. I love saying his name because <laughs> that's promo God's favorite word. Y'all know that. Fuck that, but whatever. <laughs> so I want you to tell the people when Nation of Elevation was created and what really gave you the motivation to create it. So what I did is I was always posting. I had this website called The Nation of Elevation. And what I did is I posted different buds, different marijuana buds and different wax and different cartridges okay. that I had tried or whatever. And um, I was always going live smoking and whatever. And then Russ and another guy that I don't really associate with too much anymore. Um... He said, why don't you go live? All your friends are, you know, most of your friends are musicians. Why don't you just go live and interview them and then let them try your pop? Hey. Okay. So I, I started doing that and um, he was... So it, it originally didn't start off about artists. It was started no, about just started a 420 about, friendly experience. Right, okay. Right, right. See, I didn't know that. I thought it started out with um, and, with the artists. I thought that's what it always and, was. And, you know, come, come crunch, crunch time, about a week and a half before my first interview, I was studying and researching and listening and just so I had everything under control and... As soon as it, as soon as the first interview came, I flopped. Oh. I was just like, oh, I, 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 I was stuttering. You got a little nervous. I did. But uh, he was my, he was my. Look, they're elevating. You see the cloud, people? You see the cloud? They're <laughs> elevating right now. <laughs> you get and look at the baby right there, y'all. Let me see if I can zoom in so you can see the baby. This one just, oh, look right there. Look at the baby. Oh, okay, go ahead. So I, uh... <laughs> I mean, I did it discourage you when you <coughs> when you got nervous? Did it make you feel no, like, no, I don't want to do mean, that no more? At that very moment, it did. But I learned that I just got to do more dabs before the show. <laughs> Because the nervousness goes away. Okay. Well, I'm going to tell you something. I've been on air on the radio for four years now. And even before then, I was working with radio stations. And even this day, like, you know, just getting on the air every single day, I get nervous. Right. And it's been over four years. <laughs> so it's, it's no, no single experience is the same as the next one. Right. It's, you're never, it's never the same, you know, like... I started out just musicians and then learned as I went so much and that the fact that, um, you know, this musician may just only sing or rap. Right. This musician has a whole studio and, you know, whatever else going on. And this guy mixes, masters, does it all. So I'm learning still to this day, but it's a great experience. Okay. Just to let you know, we have the CEO and owner of WBAP Bluntsville Radio tuned in in New Jersey. That is one of the stations that syndicates my show. And again, we are here with Nation of Elevation um, in Toledo, Ohio, and the co-founder of Team We, along with Promo God. We are here together um, just because we can. Team We, right? <laughs> So shout out to Forbidden Jewels. He is in here paying attention and listening. And again, yeah. we are going to run this interview because we are live on location and y'all are important. And I wanted to make sure that I got this done while I was passing through. So Definitely. Um, now, Russ, you have been part of Nation of Elevation since the very beginning. Yeah. OK, did you kind of push him along to try to keep him on his feet, keep him on his toes, keep him motivated? Try to get everything switched over to make sure that's what he really wanted to do. Okay. Instead of just jumping in, not knowing. But he, he took his time. He done a lot of research, and he spent many, many hours, days on end. Yeah. Doing the research on one certain person, then he would have to talk to somebody else who he's already had his lined up, had them do the research. And it, he, he, he did pretty good. Okay. Uh, I try to stay. You're right. I try to stay one artist ahead. 
Well, now see, that's where you you and me differ. You know, when I do interviews, I like them to be off the top of my head. And a lot of times I want it to be um, more more about only the, the person. You know, I want them to say their story in their words. You know, I don't I'm not like V Lad. I don't go um, picking out personal shit I because don't. you know I ask them simply about the movie. Oh, I've listened to your show yeah, many, many times yeah, and I've heard your questions and he does look, y'all, when he says that he does his research, he does. I just want to be, I guess. And That's I have, where I applaud you because you do a lot of research for your artists. My team, not just me, my team. Oh, so all of y'all research my the team. artists. Okay. Yeah, I just, you know, I put 100% where they're just, you know, if they're around, they'll be like, oh, listen to this and listen to that. Okay. Check this out and check this out. So it's, it's not just, I can't take a hundred, I can't take all that credit. It's, it's my team. Well, that's what I'm saying. Okay. You, including your team of people, um, because your team of people have grown since yeah. the beginning. Like you, they're, right. There are a lot of nation of elevation out there now. And you may not know that I know, but I do. I pay attention. I really do. Regardless of whether we're friends on Facebook or what have you, I always pay attention. Trust me. I'm a stalker just like other people in the room. I've taken bats. I've taken bats. <laughs> I've done an interview where two groups on a couple of times that were beefing, and you know what I mean, I put, not single-handedly, you know, with, with, with my crew, you know, I put them back on the same pace so the drama would stop there. There was another one recently. I, I just, look, you guys are all out here doing the same thing. Fuck the drama, get paper, get paid, and let's hear the music. Okay, so do you know somebody named Tone Gotti? That would be Tony o. Cleveland on yes, Facebook. I do. He's on my Facebook. Well, he is on here right now. He said, yo, my brothers, tell him I need back on here. Tone Gotti. There you go. So he is paying attention because I did. I tagged you in the post. I did so. the interview. Excuse me. I did the interview the first time with him. With him. Okay. With D-Boy. Oh, wait a minute. Is that the... um? <laughs> Is that the tall, big guy? Is that the same? Is that the one? No, the real big tall guy. <laughs> Who was that one? I remember watching him because oh, yeah, he was. Chris, yes, yes, I yes, yes. Was, you know, I was standing on a chair, probably like the third, like the second step, third step on that thing, and um, still weren't as tall as I he was is. Just as tall as him. <laughs> wow, yeah, dude was really tall. I was like, damn, that's a big boy. <laughs> I get mad up to uh, King Chris. He's doing his thing. And and so tell us about Tom Gotti since you um since he's on here. Well, <laughs> let's shout out these people because you got some people in here watching, paying attention. The counter just keeps going up and up and up. We got Jenna Sackle in Detroit. She said hashtag Detroit. So <laughs> Detroit is watching, hey, y'all. Um Cindy Grooms is in here. She says she loves this. Um for Ben Jules again, he's the CEO and owner of WBAP Bluntsville Radio. I really hey, I really want y'all, I want y'all to go network with him because he is fabulous you know he Abby. he is literally for the independent artists he because he himself is an independent artist right. so make sure that you go network with forbidden exactly. jewels um, his name is Marvin Griffin on Facebook so when you get this video you're gonna um, uh, uh, yeah. see that information on there so we're gonna say shout out to uh, Miss Harmony she is in Detroit she is an avid team we member she loves D boys music she loves promo God she loves anybody mm -hmm. that is um, elevating themselves so shout out to everybody that's on there Keith YG um, D he is in Detroit so Detroit is definitely watching y'all um, we got Maureen oh, Gilding Thompson up. absolutely a tone uh, tone east side east side tone. tone there we go um, let's see they said blessings queen we got bad boy Billy Sly and he is definitely a man to know hey. he is um, I don't know if y'all know this but he's famous I'm just saying whatever shout out to bad boy <laughs> Billy Sly in the building so he is definitely paying attention to the team we movement to nation at elevation we are truly just having a good time here we got Gregory Terrell um, national popcorn company is in the building the whole team is watching 
thing. So y'all have got some pretty important people watching y'all today. And I want your voices to be heard because you are very, very important. We got Trinidad and Tobago listening right now. So we are definitely worldwide. And D-Boy, you are important. The co-founder of Team We. We got Davey No Fucks, and I love seeing his name. <laughs> we got the um, owner of Nation of Elevation. This is my mom when I go in the house. And Russ, over there, security man, right there. He's the one protecting us all right here, right now, y'all. I go in the house, and my mom says, oh, look. It's Mr. No Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. Tommy Trax is in the building. He says, what's up? He is in New York, y'all. We got New York, Washington. We also have Sheila B. Good, and she is also WBAP Bluntsville Radio in New Jersey. So y'all have got... Oh, we also... all. Oh, oh, hold on. Y'all know the mantra. It was a Detroit number. Um, don't call. You know, you're sitting there watching me on the live. Don't call. <laughs> oh, so anyway, tell us all about yourselves, y'all. Other than a nation of elevation, what what is just the man that we're sitting here? There's a whole lot of men sitting here, right here, people. You know, like Dave is a Mr. D, Mr. D boy here is a go getter, really a, a pusher. Of course, Team Wee. And, and like I said in the beginning, you know, I don't think that there would be a nation right now if it really wasn't for him and his pushing me. Come on, he's always at my house every day. You know what I mean? Pull up, whether the snow was over the tires, it didn't matter. He was there. Right. We sit and we bullshit, shoot the shit, and just have a good time and. He keep telling me, I tell him about the artist that I, you know, got lined up and he would tell me about, yeah, well, I've heard this one and this one and this one and me, you know, we listen to music and mm -hmm. shoot like shit like you should ask him this. And, you know, so kind of at that point, it was about, it was about six, six or eight interviews after his. And he was like my third one, fourth interview. Him, it was him and Tone came in one week. Oh, that's a whole story. I'm going to tell you. <laughs> I'm going to tell you that story, too. But that that's his his pushing me is what made me what I am. And, you know, I'm a very humble man. I let a lot of stuff pass. I do. You know what I mean? And I, I When I should listen, I don't. I just go my own way. Well, I want to know this, even though you told me not to ask it. The hell with that. Right. I give you no fucks. I give no fucks. Right. You know what I mean? And then... And, and, I would ask it, and they would all be in my ass at the end of the show, like we told you, we told blah, blah, mm -hmm. blah, well, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Very, if I see something that I want to know, and I pick through a lot of questions, mm -hmm. a lot, I just don't pick the first five questions, come to my, I ask 25 questions, 20 to 25 questions, and... It's some, you know, how'd you grow up type, you know, where'd mm -hmm. you grow, not how, where'd you grow up at, you know what I mean, uh, you know, uh, was music your whole thing life, you know, tell me about yourself. Right. You know, them kind of questions, then it goes into the music, you know, I heard this song, just, you know what I mean, mm -hmm. I, keep it, I keep, I try to keep the interview solely about what the, the, the community's got. Right. Um, whether it's music, someone that does art. I see, he's different from us, though, because, I mean, like, I'll, I'll listen to something, and you got 30 seconds. I'm, Me too. In the first 30 seconds, I am off it. My God, <laughs> I'm listening to the whole track. And, and yeah, and, no. I don't, need, I don't need to hear all of this to know it's garbage. You know, and, 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 and that's because, now. that's because... That's the difference between what you guys do and I do. I I, I think I, it's more for me. Well, it's because get, of the multitude of music right, that I have to go through. Like you, right. like I, I can't sit and listen to a thousand songs all the way through. You have got to catch my attention within the first twenty to thirty seconds. And that see me like I'll, I'll I have a power hour before my show usually, mm -hmm. and I play like the artist at hand. I'll play a couple of songs from them, and whether they're trash or not. And, and and trust me, get down. Oh, and trust me, it's, right. it's been it's I, I, everybody that does music or everybody that does something for the city. That's a talent. Right. Give a shit what it is and how you sound. Art is art. 
I mean, it's not. A, I, I mean, I can't really go as far as saying, you know, I don't care how you sound. The thing is, you know what I'm saying, you can tell what you're know saying, you know what I'm saying, no time, no matter. Anybody can make music. Right, right. But right. I'm still, it's, I mean, it's, but it it's, takes more than just making music, you know what I'm saying, to make music. And, right. You can't just throw that, something together that you're ready. Right. Right. Who did? No, no I'm. My daughter could have did that. Right. right. Like that's right. ABC. Let's elementary. Yeah. Yeah. Let's um, kick it up a notch. Reading. We, what are you reading? Right. Right. Especially nowadays. I mean, music is, I mean, music a whole lot different. I mean, nowadays, I mean, no, I mean, you ain't going to just say hop, skip, jump. And just, right. I have a sound my, on this beat. In my phone, I have a lot of un, unplayed music that is so fired that. I would love to just sit and play. I don't know what But I, I didn't get, I didn't, you know what I mean? Most of the artists just, I don't know if it's not playing. This just fell off or whatever. <laughs> it's just, they put effort in it and then just let it go. Right. I, I try to not let them let it go. Sometimes people get into the music industry to be not a professional artist, no, but a right. hobbyist. Right. That's what I call them, Hobby Lobby. You feel me? Yep. Yep. <laughs> like, if you are really not in it to... Um, Win, then why do it? I mean, it's make the money that you can make doing it, but it has to make you happy to do it. it ha you have to love what you do. A lot of people that just have a hobby, they don't really necessarily love that hobby. Right, they they do just want to do it to kill time. Right. right. I, I avoid, I, I, I try to avoid it. You know, I'd say I listen, and I do listen to some of it, but some of it I just, once you hear a little bit of it and it's trash, you're just like, oh, okay. Right. It makes you really not want to listen to any more music that they do. Right, right. Because then it becomes annoying and you have to um, force yourself to really listen to it. Right. But... Promo God does play every single song that comes to my email, regardless of whether it is a brand new artist or if it is a seasoned artist in the industry. I play, I give everybody a chance. Now, because I run a Facebook Live while I'm doing the show, um, that allows the people to come in and they can critique the music. Now, mind you, I don't let people be disrespectful at all. I don't let people come in there and say, oh, your music is trash. No, we don't do that here. You can voice your opinion, but do it in a respectful way. Right. You know, we're not trying to put somebody under the bus. We're not trying to hurt somebody or make them, you know, crush their dream with the words that we say. Just help them. Tell them what it is that they could do to make it better. Words are more so. crucial than getting shot. Right. They hurt longer. They well, songs longer. prove that. When y'all write songs, when you um, put your heart into what you do, and, you know, it shows. Yeah. yeah. We hear stories every single day. Team We is a story. If you really listen to the so Team like We theme it. song, yeah. that is a story. It tells, and he drops names of everybody. So, I mean, I really, I mean, big ups to... Yeah. I don't forget. I remember everybody. Right. When we started. Definitely big ups to In The Gym. In The Gym Entertainment LLC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I already know. I mean, I just, I mean, I try to keep, I don't know, first of all, I try to keep working. I mean, I gotta, right. I, I have to keep working, but I mean, no matter what's going on around me, and I'm still doing it. I'm, I mean, trust me, I'm still Every doing time I And look, y'all, I jumped on his ass as soon as I walked in the so door about the new Team We song. I really did. TV I jumped on his ass like, uh, where's the new song? I got my phone. We can Bluetooth it right now. Give me the new song. Yeah, he ain't even got it done yet, y'all. But he has, look, I'm saying it live on air right now. So we have got proof. He has to have the new Team We song to me by March 1st to get it on the new Team We series mixtapes this year. It'll be on there March 1st on the Tuesday uh, team. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's the elevation. The new team is <laughs> next I have it done March 1st. Right. Yeah. So, we, you heard it, people. We are sticking him to yeah, it. Yeah, she, she didn't even come in yet. yet. Was I was like, hi, how you doing? Where's the new song? I, I need like to get it. It didn't come to the email. Where is it at? I will stay in his ass. <laughs>
<laughs> I just picked up my phone like, hey, you know what? Um, I'm, I, I'm in your area, you know what I'm saying? What are you doing? I said, oh, uh, he's oh, saying, oh, 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 you're in my area. You <laughs> say hours away. I mean, I, how was you just I'm in there? I was literally I around the corner. I knew what Didn't, was. yeah. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. I told him, like, oh, yeah, when she come in here, man, the first thing she's going to say is good summer. And she sat here and tried to be patient about it. Too. I did. I, I tried. tried to be patient hey, y'all. I'll keep it 100. This song is fire. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, got, I mean, <laughs> Yeah, I mean. It okay, well, play. he knows that I don't play when we're in the gym, and it ain't no game, it ain't, right? It ain't being played. We're in the gym, and it ain't no game. So, um, promo God, don't play that shit, right? I knew, I knew. Okay. What was about to happen? I mean, we are partners right. in Team We. That's we are partners right. forever. You know what I'm saying? We are linked to Team We forever. That's always going to be that. So, um, no, we need to do song, motherfucker. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh shit I'm just saying <laughs> and see they're in here saying they're waiting for the new song so yeah, 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 yeah. they're so they, you know yeah, the next CD, next CD. make sure y'all blow up his Facebook <laughs> Yeah, that's David D Boy Knowles, or you can go to um, D Boy on his fan page, or you can just hit promo god, and I will forward all the fucking messages because um, we're not playing that shit. <laughs> Yeah, man. Just every last one of them. I'm just saying. Like, oh, I just got up and I got like 60 messages. Here you go. Make sure y'all get on the fan page, though, for real. Okay, is okay. Let's do that. Let's, let's get the social media information for I, Nation of Elevation I, and Davy No Fucks, Davy Bone, Davy Bonner, yeah, 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 or yeah, what? Yeah, yeah. Shit, he has got 20 million thousand Facebooks and shit. But we're gonna let him give his social media information because <laughs> I don't know at all. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna get some pads. Actually, pads. for the Nation of Elevation, you just go on there into the groups and just the Nation of Elevation. It'll, it'll, it'll save you. Okay, is it a group or is it a fan page? It's a group. Okay. It's, it's, it's where I put my shows when so they can go, people can go back. I'm not in that. Them. I was looking for a fan page. I think that's why I never found it. I always came to your profile. No, I make a fan page. I might have to look oh, for that. Okay. Um, and on YouTube, it's. Uh, it's uh day dad daddy I think. Yeah. It's what? Exactly dad, dad, dad. D A B Daddy okay. on uh YouTube. Dab Daddy on YouTube, y'all. You heard that? That's where it goes down. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, come here. Uh, yeah, right. Do you have an email that people could submit information um, to you? Music, maybe, that you could listen to, and maybe you wanted um, to do an yes, interview? I do, actually. It's D Bonner, B O H N E R, 920 at gmail.com. Okay. Um, you can send me music, and I promise you, once we get things ready and back up on the air, I will play the hell out of it. Hey, hey. So. That would be my next question. When do you think the next in, um, episode of Nation of Elevation will be coming out? Well, let me leave that to, to my higher manager. Okay, let's just put it in a range. Would it be before summertime? Before summer? Um, yes. Okay. Yes. I don't want to stick you to a certain date. I don't want to, you know, do that. But any just a range. Any other time as when we're going to do a show. You'll have to inbox, like I said, D Boy. He takes care of all that. I do all my scheduling, but because of things that are going on, us trying to push shit together, they've been on hold. So now we're starting to get things together, and it won't be long, I promise. Okay, great. Okay, so um, who? That was like y'all. He blessed us with not giving all of his um, Facebook information because we would have been here for days. No, um, he literally has twenty seven thousand yeah, fucking no. Facebook profiles. They can add me on this one. It's just Dave Bone, and it's me standing in front of the microphone. Right. It's a, I think it's a black and white picture, yes. isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So it's him standing in front of a microphone. It's black and white. It's Dave. Is it Davey Bone? D A V E. Bone. Okay, Dave Bone. Yeah, I just added it because I had him on a totally different one. <laughs> 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 
Russ, we need your um, Mr. Security Man. We need your social media information for these people because you're the important one sitting here. Pretty much fall under his. Oh, okay. So we can find him under you. Okay. He said he he ain't giving out shit, people. Yeah, because he's 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 a private guy. That's right. That's what security is supposed to be. Be private. They don't need to know all your business because um, right. And I I mean I I post other stuff on my page, which I keep my personal right. Go. The Absolutely. Right. Well, we appreciate you and all the hard work that you do to make sure that these gentlemen and the whole team, because again, y'all, they have got a big team of people. Um, he keeps them all safe. So thank you. I mean, you, you never know when something pops off. I mean, I mean somebody's got to protect and try to be there. I mean, right. Yeah. Trying to keep the peace. Absolutely. Absolutely. I give a shout out to Tessa and Jay Dabs for sure. Okay. This dude is knocking the walls out of my Facebook. Hey, hey. Well, is he commenting on your on the um in my inbox. Oh, okay. Straight to the inbox. I can't. Oh, say because the live that's running on Facebook right now. Oh, okay. Oh, right, 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 right. Because you're yeah, he's bad, y'all. He's blocked on Facebook. He can't do shit. Facebook is a felon. Facebook felon. Facebook Look, I am a repeat offender. I know. I it's what it is what it is. And I just recently made this Facebook because I've been in the other one the, the other two that I was using because I had two phones at the time. Right. And he's uh, locked out of all of them, y'all. They're all locked out. So I made this new one and I don't know what happened. I added one guy and I thought he was the one that was hating and then sir, as soon as I added him the next day I was, I was kicked off with the uh, I'm just now able to talk in the storyline. Wow. Yeah. Or go live. It's horrible. Bad boy over there. Yeah. Alright, so we got the man, D boy. I'm, I'm, I'm not D man. I'm, you know what I'm saying. I'm, I be standing next to him. You know what I'm saying. Sometimes, you know what I'm saying. But I mean, I'm, okay. I'm well, okay. we need to get your social media information again. Uh, reminder of who you are. David D boy knows on Facebook. Uh, D boy on YouTube. Um, I mean, you can find me on, I mean, I get a lot of team we notifications. I get a lot of, you know what I'm saying? I only get a few notifications I on my D-Boy page. I don't, I don't know what's, what, what well, that's about. People don't really like the, the guy D-Boy, obviously. Okay, well, they obviously do because Team We. So yeah, if you're getting a lot of notifications from Team We, no and Team We is part of you. <laughs> you <laughs> they definitely part of me. We, so... We rock Team We on the daily basis. I mean, like you said, it's not just on Wednesday. So that's, that's right. Literally, y'all, we have in this room sitting the two founders of Team We. You are looking at one and you are listening to one right here. So, it's a um, lot of stuff coming this year, too. Yeah. Like, Rona ain't stopped. It ain't stopping nothing. I mean, we, let, yeah, man, please take me. Yeah. You're, you're letting him, you're taking, uh, yeah. Let him go for he, <laughs> he gets. He gets irate off of me. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff coming, you know what I'm saying, this year, man. Uh, I got some new music. Uh, I got some new merchandise coming. Uh, some new Team We shirts, man. I, I think everybody's tired of wearing the old Team We shirts. Okay, well, I will never get tired of wearing mine, I mean, so whatever. I mean, I, I don't get tired of wearing them, but you know what I'm saying? I might need it, you know what I'm saying? A different one, you know what I'm saying? A new color, you know what I'm saying? A new look, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes, I mean... Okay, well, do what you do. Uh, I'm, Shit. I'm doing it. It's just the boy. Cross it. My bad. They over there making noise, y'all. Okay, run down all of your um, social media. Because you have uh, Instagram as yeah, well. Instagram. I, I see that's the Instagram. YouTube, uh, too. Uh, YouTube is just D-Boy. Uh, Instagram. Uh, man, I, see, man. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. 
Okay, well, you can always go to the video and draw. Oh, that's what I want y'all to do is the video of the, um, oh, you can't because you're fucking blocked. <laughs> Damn it, man. Okay, so what you can do, you can send messages in um, in your inbox, right? No, you'll have to, I'll give you my number. Instagram. And you can text me or inst uh, my, what else I got? Yeah, you can just, I'll give you my number. Oh, I thought you could get messages. I can get Send them. messages I can on. Get them. I just can't receive them. The only place I can write at is in my storyline on Facebook or my live right at this moment. So when they block you on Facebook, you can't send any messages on Messenger? Yeah, that's a new kind of shit because I ain't never been blocked from that. I've been blocked since October. Wow. <laughs> okay, so... I'll just give you, um, I'll give you my business card and you can just um, text me your Gmail information. Yeah. That way I can put that in the Facebook Live that's running right now. Okay. All right, D-Boy, did you pull up the information? Yeah, for? Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. we're back over here. Yeah, Let's... yeah we're back over here. <laughs> finally, so. finally. D-Boy knows, I mean, I told you this. D-Boy knows on uh, Instagram. We, we go D-Boy, D-B-O-I knows. I mean, if you're on the uh, SoundCloud, uh, Twitter. I'm mean, out, man. Twitter, Twitter. Twitter's a whole bunch of numbers. Yeah, I got Twitter, man. That's now, look, when y'all go look for the Facebook one, the um, fan page for D-Boy, make sure that you are looking for the one that I think it has a banner or something that says in the gym. Yeah. Because if it's yeah. not in the gym, it's yeah. not yeah. him. Man. Hey, that rhymes! <laughs> Oh, that was not planned, y'all. I was oh, just trying to, you yeah. know, be professional. He's right there. Look, y'all. Um, yeah. I'm gonna have to find. I'm gonna have to put a, a five percent uh, finder's fee yeah. on that. I'm just saying. Um, Copyright that shit. Bow. Cash app it. <laughs> dollar sign promo god ss. <laughs> That's great. Oh shit. Oh man, this one, man. Is that what? Mm, right. mm, mm. Yeah, I think that's it, man. Okay. I mean, you can find me on Facebook, uh, Instagram. Mm, yeah. Look, he's listening I, to it on Facebook. Yeah, he always got his phone all up. He's loud. He's got his iPhone and stuff, man. With them six by nines in, in the back of the phone. Wow. <laughs> on Facebook, you know what I'm saying? Mm, Twitter. Mm, mm. Uh, I mean, D-Boy. I mean, look for D-Boy. I mean, if... You don't know me, you know what I'm saying? You're going to see in the gym. If it don't say in the gym, it ain't him. Or, you know, to make it even more simple, just type in hashtag Tag Team we, and it's going to pull him up, me, and everything that has to do with Team yeah, we, we. So we, uh, A bunch of group pictures in the Team We page, too. Davy Bone, Dave, Dave, Davey No Dave. Fucks is watching. There his name is. Let's wave Dave. at him. Randall Benefield, we see you, sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, look, y'all that are listening and watching from Facebook Live, um, I apologize if I missed your comments. Please understand that I am not ignoring you. Um, I just sometimes they don't come through until after I am off the live. So please understand I'm not ignoring you. But if you are in here listening, Listening, or you have been listening, I truly, truly appreciate y'all. Um, y'all want to do some shout outs before we get off of here? See, I just like having a conversation with the people, and these are uh, my people, y'all. So, first and foremost, I want to give a shout out to my people in, in the gym. In the gym. We, we entertainment. Um, I want to give a shout out to Uncle Russ, uh, Tessa, J Dabs, and Every independent artist, every underground artist, come see me. Yard. Hey, hey. Toledo, Ohio, the glass city representing the nation of elevation. We're going to get a see if we can zoom in on the sign back there. We tried to hang it up, y'all, and it was um, it wasn't happening. Oh, thank you, Uncle Russ. We appreciate that. Nation of elevation right there, y'all. See, see with Dave, no fuck. See, I wasn't lying. That's his name. <laughs> thank you sweetie for pulling that up i appreciate it so go ahead finish your shout outs um anybody else I, like i said any artist that's interested just hit me up 
You okay. know what I mean? I don't care what you got going on. We'll figure it out. I love all music. Hey, hey, all genres. I love all art, and I love anything and everything that puts on for my city. And he does car shows too, y'all. Yeah, summertime we do the car And shows. I can't wait to see more pictures of uh, Nova Kane because <laughs> woohoo, that is a badass car, and it is an award. You're looking at an award winner right here. He. Um, <laughs> Many trophies and awards for that Nova Kane. And I'm telling y'all, when he posts them pictures at the next car show, I will be oh, sharing yeah. that shit because that shit is hot. Soon to come, <laughs> pictures of it all tore apart. Oh, wow. <sighs> You're rebuilding it? No, he just, no, we, we, we changed the, it, it's got a 383 stroker in it with nitrous. Right. So what we did is just change the chrome to copper. Oh. Under the hood, get a whole bunch of copper work. We're going to take that, you know, got to do some general maintenance on the motors. So okay. So we keep the hell out of it all summer. Look, y'all, when I tell you this is a badass car, it is a badass car award. So you're looking at a winner right there, regardless of Team Wee. And He's even Wednesday. Hey, hey. It is, it is Wednesday. Wednesday. Yes, it is Wee Team Wee Wednesday, y'all. Happy Team Wee Wednesday. Look, mine is faded, y'all. My shit is just, um, yeah, mine is is orange on both sides <laughs> but i wear it all the time so you know um uncle russ would you like to shout anybody out you good look he said move on <laughs> we got um d-boy right here give us your shout out sir man i mean shout out my kids your friend i mean my homies you know what i'm saying my team you know what i'm saying love jones uh uh, I mean, the whole team, we family, you know what I'm saying? And I mean, everybody got a sweet thing, not a neat thing. So, yeah, I, I mean, I couldn't, I couldn't do what I do if it wasn't, I mean, if it wasn't for everybody else. And, That's right. You know, we keep pushing each other, you know what I'm saying? We winners elevate. Winners elevating team, we. Thank you. Thank you. I just want to say I appreciate it. It has been a rough day for me today. And to stop by here and be able to do this on location interview while I was traveling through, I um, it made my day. So thank you for answering the message. Because, um, look, y'all, you know he's a, t a Tim Hortons addict. So I'm going to take him and go get him a coffee. <laughs> I had to send him a message. I said, hey, I am um, coming through Toledo on my way home, and um, would you like to get a coffee? Well, first I said breakfast, and then I remembered he really doesn't eat oh, breakfast. So I just went ahead and said, um, or coffee. <laughs> <laughs> I knew once I said coffee and that would be what look he's holding the Tim Hortons in his hand that's not even the one that I'm going to get for him so <laughs> see y'all when you all tell me secrets and you tell me little things about yourselves I remember those little things okay so I will try to you know hey entice you with whatever it is that you like like i know that you like what you like right. mr nation elevation yeah. we know what you yeah. like yeah. so i would try to entice you with um hey can i stop by and let's smoke a blunt you feel what i'm saying yeah, we'll see that would entice him to you know get up and enjoy his day make somebody happy make somebody smile right. and that's what it's all, all right. about so again thank you for making me smile today it was an honor to truly meet thank you me. first time in person um you know this is like we were supposed to do this in august so i appreciate you letting me come and get y'all's beautiful faces i love y'all's faces thank you thank you thank you yes it's just, I mean, it's funny, you know what I'm saying? It was Wednesday. I didn't, think I didn't even... Like, Look, this I day said, has been... Um, I, said, I said, winning. it's Wednesday and we're winning. Look at your messages. Well, I'm just saying, <laughs> I was having a rough, rough day. So, um, y'all made my day today. Thank you very much. And the stars had lined for Mr. Man to want to get a coffee. So, yeah, thank I'm you. <laughs> On this song, I got yelled at, you know what I'm saying, about Sunday. I mean, like, Sunday. Yeah, the Team Wee really song needs to get done. When I seen the coffee message, I knew what this was about. Like, oh, Whatever, you know, dude. She's going to sit down in the first, I mean, as soon as we just sat down and got coffee. You don't know me like that, partner. Um, 
What about that song? Uh, March first. March first. I'm yep. thinking, yo, I got a few weeks, man. March first is like next week. So yeah. 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 Oh damn! Isn't that close? Well, yeah, it's. Damn near, it seems like it. I mean, this week will be. Um, well, today's the tenth. So you've got. Yeah, because it's a short month. So. You got 18 days. That's what you got. Y'all heard that? 18 days. I want somebody to type that right there in the comments. Uh, Miss Harmony, um, uh, Forbidden Jewels, Miss uh, Sheila, one of y'all. Can you type that in the comment section? Because we're gonna end this. We're gonna end this Facebook Live. We are gonna run this interview on air next week. So I want somebody to type in there. 18, 18 days. Type that in there for me. Do that solid. <laughs> All right, y'all. Welcome to... Again, big shout out to Nation of Elevation and Team We co-founder, Davey No Fucks and D-Boy. Truly appreciated. We did pre-record the interview. It was last week. We ran it today. Happy Team We Wednesday. This is a world premiere by the co-founder of Team We. This is D-Boy, Toledo, Ohio, in the gym entertainment. The song is called Toledo. And if you ain't, then go and miss me with that negative energy. My horizon still rising. Ain't no room for a silly. I'll be on the air side and everybody safe in my whip. A mud baby. Shout out to Michelle Lee, R&B Key, Johnny Dimitri, Randall Benefit. Field. Shout out to D-Boy, Miss Harmony, Detroit. Shout out to Nicholas Rodriguez in Columbia. Shout out to Tulo Esteban, love from Detroit coming in. Shout out to Lizzie Marie Hubbard in the building. Shout out to Eddie Eze, Detroit, Charles Baldwin, Rel G's, and Lisa Johnson. Do I to put us back on the map? So I guess you and I united is the star of the deck. Excuse me. Excuse me. I hope you don't mind, but I used to rhyme. Miss Harmony, you said great interview. Thank you. I appreciate that. That's right, Lizzie. You heard 18 days. Well, he has, uh, today's the 17th. He has 11 days now. You heard that, D-Boy. I know that you're listening right now. You got 11 days, dude. <laughs> Or diseases, it didn't matter. I was feed her. Long as money, what they bring her. And I could have leave her and believe her. The way they come back, you could call me greedy. My relationship with cash, you could call me. Miss Harmony said, We love you, D boy. Hey, you must be Corey Matthews. Call me Mr. Feeney. I ain't eating ramen noodles no more. This linguine. I'm high off in the moonrise, though. You can't see me. Welcome to Toledo. Couldn't be a me thing if not for a we thing. Together we gon' elevate one another. That's right. Lizzie, he better be in the gym working right now. That's what he better be doing. He better be listening to the show and in the gym getting that Team We song done because the mixtape is complete. We're just waiting on our new song, D-Boy. Hey! I'm from the city of the Rockets. Grimey spot on who would never venture to go shopping. Home with Jimmy Jackson like Jenny. This shirt they murdered out late night. Murdered the lead in his legs to the slaughter. I brought up. D-Boy said he is in the gym right now and ain't no games being played. That's right. Get that song to us, sweetie. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Again, big shout out to Nation of Elevation. Shout out to Team Wee. Hey, shout out to Toledo, Ohio, the glass city. Hot thoughts with a dirt box, scheming to make a nigga run. Understand my city like Jekyll and Hyde. These jackals removing your hide. That's right. No rest for the wicked, Miss Harmony. With the killer type, Takashi Brown here. We gonna money the moonlight. This ain't the city for sight. See him better turn around. Land the human traffic and real pimping is going down. How many the streets like the epidemic that killed the east? Made the crime right high, turn the things to zombies. Yeah, and that's the city where I call home. Marked up blocks with bullet holes through the tombstones. Yeah, and it's the city that I call home. Marked up blocks with bullet holes through the tombstones. You understand my city like Jekyll and Hyde. These jackals removing your hide. And if you step out of bounds, whoa. Slow it down, not nah, hang around with the killer type Takashi round here. We gun them under the moonlight. Welcome to Toledo.
Tabitha Razoo. Big shout out to Toledo, Ohio, all the artists, independent and otherwise. We see y'all. Promo guy. Underground sound off. Sound off. Kill shot hour. All right, y'all, if you're a loyal listener, you know exactly what that means. It is time for me to get up out of here. I have been in here way too long. <clears throat> but before I go, I do want to remind you, we do have another interview tomorrow with the GOAT. Um, shout out to MJ's Hip Hop Connects for always getting us in touch with the artists that I wouldn't normally be able to find. So um, we got that interview coming up tomorrow. Again, happy Team We Wednesday. And if you're a member of Team We, you already know what it takes to be part of Team We. All you have to do is believe in yourself. Believe in yourself enough to help another to believe in themselves. Because it's a we thing, not a me thing. There's not enough people out here that believe in themselves and that's what we're here to do we are winners elevating every single day even though we celebrate it on wednesday we elevate each other every single day it's a we thing not a me thing remember that i need y'all to do three things for me today i need you to inspire someone smile for someone and tell someone you love them because you may not have the opportunity to do tomorrow what you can do today and wouldn't that be a shame again you've been listening to promo god underground sound off the kill shot hour syndicated and powered by ksir kill shot internet radio detroit michigan wbap bluntsville radio new jersey blast global radio detroit michigan gsfm radio philly WNDO, Hot 109.9 FM, Miami, Florida, and Hood X Radio, Chicago, Illinois. Promo God is broadcasting live from Columbus, Ohio, and I'm getting the music out there to the world the best way that I know how. Why? Because I love you. Good night.